What's up, y'all? This your girl, Go Mouth. I am coming back to y'all today to show you guys um, a few of the bonnets that I have. Um, well, I'm only going to show you like four of them because I don't want to show all of them at one time. I'll probably show all of them at, at the same time at a later date because it's going to be a real long video, y'all. Because I know people, a lot of people got, you know, impatient because I am um, short attention span. Anyways, um, I'm going to show you guys what I call the Diva Bunnets because I um they're so like diva fast so bougie and stuff like that you know for the 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 lady who like purses and girly things and you know shoes and and you know all of that pink and glitter and stuff so the first bunnet i have which is one of my newest bunnets and it is pink um i guess i'm gonna show that one to you in a second well here you go right here child i don't know what i'm doing but anyway this is the first bunnet right here this is what i call the pink high heel shoe bunnet i believe that's what it's called on the site and it looks like this and this is my model here her name is whitney <laughs> her name is whitney and this is what this bunnet looks like this bunnet is pink and it has all kind of high heel shoes on it if you're girly and it got some sparklies in the shoe like some glitter sparkles in the shoe i'm not sure if y'all could see that up close but the inside if y'all can see that little silver line on each shoe they have a little bit of glittery sparkles in it not sure how well that pays off on camera let me see if y'all seeing this okay okay y'all might be seeing it a little bit right there see the sparkles in it okay so each one of these bonnets do have the sparkle in them. So this is what this bonnet looks like. This is very, very pretty. I thought, oh, everybody like pink, so why not go ahead and get a pink bonnet? Underneath it is lined with satin, and the satin is pink as well. And let me take a let me look. They don't laugh right here now. I'm put her back. Put her down. This was my, um, when I was in cosmetology school, y'all, that was my, these are my dolls from cosmetology school. No, I didn't throw none of my mannequins away, but anyway, this is what it looks like underneath. This is like a rose colored pink that's underneath here. This is the part that goes on your hair. This is not a reversible bonnet because this side right here is cotton and you don't want to put that side on your head. You know, that's because that's a cute side. I'll put it on like that. And um, if y'all want me to try it, let me go and try it on for y'all so y'all can see how much hair I got versus the small, what it is. This is the regular size bonnet and put it on for y'all just show you guys how much hair that it does hold and as y'all can see i have a i have a i guess i would say i got a full head of hair <laughs> do i got a full head of hair y'all but this is what this bonnet looks like on an actual person which is me i'm the person okay so this bonnet is it holds up the shoulder length hair now at first originally when i was as y'all can see this is all my hair packed in there um, when I originally started making the bunnets, I would only make this size, but a lot of people requested me to go larger. So that's why you see two different sizes on my website, larger, and then I call this one a regular size. I wouldn't call it small because they can still fit the head. The size of the cap, when I say large and regular, that is the size of this right here, how much hair you can hold in it. Now, I can put my hair under here um, comfortably, comfortably the black girl it's comfortable for my hair to be under here um but my only but is about the size of this one is that if you got a lot of hair like me it's going to be uh push down if you have a certain style like see i have an afro and for a regular size bonnet to cover my afro is going to make it you know squeeze you know and sometimes you want a bonnet that's going to be big enough to hold like your style and not flatten it out you know so that's might be another reason why you would want a larger bonnet but if you don't have that much hair or if you keep your hair styles and styled in a way that it's not all over your head like mine is right now then you probably will be good with this size but what i would personally recommend is you would probably have both sizes if you're the type of person that wear weaves or stuff or sometimes you got hair like me you got big hair some days and some days you got small hair then you might want to get a bigger bonnet but as you can see you know i don't have that much hair but i do have a a decent amount and it does fit the regular size bonnet and i'm going to show you guys the 
other bunny. Now, by the way, this one is called, I think it's called a Peak High Heel Shoe Bunny. Yeah, look on the website. I'm going to leave all the information in the description box below in the comment section. Y'all already know. Look on the screen, goldencreations.webs.com. Okay. So, the next bunny I have. Oh, let me put a bunny back on. Let me put a bunny back on. You got to go. Put your bunny back on. Oh, y'all, this is what she looked like without a bunny. <laughs> This is what I did in cosmetology school when I have nothing better to do with myself. She she was a actual winner of uh, a prize. She was a when we had a hair contest, child. But um, she was way better than that back in the day. Well, it wasn't back in the day, but you know when I was in school. So next one that I have on is this is the same exact bonnet except it's in black and this it does have the pink heels and it does have the glitter sparkles in it glitter sparkles or should i say shimmery i don't know what it's it's blingy 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 if you any type of female that like high heel shoes or bling or pink or anything you ain't even got to like high heel shoes because i don't wear high heels and i love these high heel buttons i will these i be wearing these things out the door to the walmart everywhere okay everywhere that they say don't wear bunnies say I, my bunnies be there on my head okay okay yeah that's me <laughs> so um this bunnet right here is girl put, put your bunnet up over your eyes you can't see nothing girl come on with your little head self. Um, this bunny is satin line with pink under it as well. And I will show you a side by side of the white one and the pink one. They both the regular size, and that's what they look like neck and neck on the head. Okay, black and pink. Same bunny, you know, you might want to feel, you might feel like this one day, or you might feel a little black one day, you might feel a little pink one day, just, you know, whatever. And this is what they bunny, hey girl, my sister from another monster. Okay, so that is what the black bunny looks like. And the next one that I have, it involves shoes as well. This bunny is a pink color, but it's kind of like, to me, I feel like it's a more darker peach color. Mauve. What color is mauve? Is mauve peach or is that burgundy? I don't know. But this is like a darker pink, like a mauve... I keep saying mauve, but you know what peach like a dark peach color because compared to the other ones this one is more these pinks are more um dark and uh this is called the book and shoe bunny these have little books under it and it had the heel sitting on top of the book so if you like into your uh if you like reading or if you going to school or whatever you ain't got to be doing nothing to like this bunny because this is one of my favorite this whole line right here is just my favorite every bunny i make is my favorite child so you're gonna hear me say that a thousand times but this bunny right here has the book and the shoes and it also has letters on it it says london uh paris and it says new york right here shout out to new york all my sisters who we buy bunnies in new york shout out to y'all i love y'all man i always see new york coming through um when i be placing my when i be filling my orders this is paris london um rome and new york okay so that is what that bunnet looks like this is the regular size bonnet as well she got to lean into the side honey and this one is lined with black it's black underneath this one so if i should have took it off my head and did it like i did the other one well since those two was alike i'm just going to show you guys the inside of this bonnet and it is black and it is very pretty this is the side that touches your hair and on me this bonnet looks like this regular size like that on me honey so that is what this one looks like and i think it is so cute y'all y'all if y'all ain't got y'all no bunny yet, don't sleep on me okay all these bunnies that i sell as proceeds towards my medical bills oh what's wrong with my neck the proceeds going towards my medical bills child my neck hurt after doing that so anyways um this is what she looked like without her bonnet on girl <laughs> throwback uh finger waves that i did on her uh 
I didn't do these. I didn't do these hairstyles when I was in school. I did them actually before I left Florida. It's been a while, but hey, they they mannequins. They don't have to have their hair every done every week. So she still done had these manic these finger waves in here for a couple of years now, girl. Um, yes, I am the finger wave slayer. I can't never show y'all my work because I don't never have nobody to work on. Okay, so um, well not not anyways. Anyways, chat, we're gonna go to the. Last but not least, Bunnet, okay? This is my most popular, um, this is my most popular Bunnet of those, those little diva ones I just showed you guys. And this Bunnet is called the Purse and Shoe Bunnet. A lot of you ladies out there like this Bunnet. Um, y'all always ordering this Bunnet. This Bunnet is like always in rotation, honey. Um, so this is the Purse and Shoe Bunnet. I call this one the Purse and, Purse and Shoe? Yeah, because it got little purses right here. See, that's a pocketbook right there. And it also has a perfume bottle. So, I don't know why I didn't mention the perfume bottle, but I call it the person shoe bunny. Because I ain't want to have like a thousand names, you know. See the perfume bottle, the shoes. The shoes got a little pom-pom on top. And... And the little purse, all of it, all of the items got little bling. Well, you know what? In this one, the shoes on this one don't have bling. It's only bling on the um the purse and the perfume bottles got little bling on them. But honey, it's enough to set this thing off. Okay, she set it off oh, on, up under here and up under this one. She has pink satin as well. And I'm gonna take hers off of y'all and show you guys what it looked like up underneath her. Bunny, it is pink satin line, and that part goes against your hair. If you want to see me with this bunny on, hold on, let me try it on for you. Okay. Woo! Okay, this is what I look like with the bunny on a real human head because I know a lot of times people say, Oh, my head bigger than a mannequin head. Um, so I wonder if it'll fit me. Yes, my head is bigger than the average head straight up i think my head is 24 and a half inches big round and i don't think nobody head bigger than that <laughs> is it 24 or 25 no i don't know it's huge but this is what my um this is what it look like in the back y'all and it's bling bling and it's so pretty y'all i if i was to pick my favorite one out of all of these i can't even i don't know i don't have a favorite all of my butt is my favorite and this is what her hair looks like and underneath is pink lining. Show y'all her hair. Hairstyle I did back in the days. Yeah, right before I moved here. And why well, I'm showing off her. Oh, whatever. So this is what this bunny looks like. The person's shoe bunny. And this one is the the black high heel shoe bunny. The black with pink heels bunny. And this one is the the pink. This is this is pink bunny with pink high heels. Shy. Got to get it out, y'all. And this one is the book and shoe bunny. Okay. So let me put them side by side for you guys. This is gonna be just like hold up. Wait a minute. Right here, pink high heels. No, what that is. Right here, the book and shoe bunny. See the book. In the shoe right here pink high heels bunny right here the black with the pink heels bunny and right here is the purse and shoe bunny okay you guys okay you guys i have done all of the bunnies in that you know that they kind of relate to each other and um you know sometimes um these linings underneath may vary depending on when I make them. But right now, I think all of these, what's under here is what you're going to get. Because sometimes you, they might vary in color. Sometimes you might get a black. Sometimes you might get a pink. But at the end of the day, whatever color underneath the, the lining of the bunny is going to match. Okay? It's going to match. So, anyways, you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. Just remember all proceeds so for my bunny. So, I go into my medical bills. Y'all, thank y'all. I appreciate y'all so much, man. Some of y'all just... Oh my God, I can't even explain it, but I love y'all so much and thank you guys so much for watching this video. Y'all stay tuned for the next video. If y'all want to see a particular bunny on my website that's on my website right now, let me know in the comment section below and then I will try to put that bunny in my next video, okay? Okay guys, thank you guys so much for watching. That's all I got to say in this video and I will holler at y'all later. Bye!